Oh boy, it has been a while since I've done any sort of uh, YouTube thing. How do I start videos? Do I start videos? I don't start videos. That's what I do. Um, right. The reason why I am actually making a video after so long of not doing that, lately there have been a lot of comments on my queer platonic videos and I had no idea why this could be the case, but then I remembered that tomorrow is Valentine's Day. And as it turns out, there are a bunch of people out there, like myself, who have non-normative experiences with romance and stuff. So I guess, in a sense, this is an update video, but not on why I haven't been doing YouTube or what the rest of my life has entailed, but just to let you know that I am still here as a 24-year-old with a queer platonic partner. We are still together. Very happy. She is seeing multiple other people, and I assume she is celebrating Valentine's Day with at least one of them. I haven't bothered to check because I don't really think about Valentine's Day at all. Personally, I am not in a romantic relationship at the moment. I might be at some point in the near future. I'm not really sure because romance is hard and I don't experience romantic attraction that often. Perhaps a topic for another video, I suppose. But to keep this short and sweet and relatively easy for me to edit, you are completely valid if you are alone this Valentine's Day for whatever reason. May that be that you have a non-normative experience of romance and romantic attraction, or if you're just single and would like to be in a romantic relationship, that's cool too. I feel that, even though I'm a Rosebeck. And to be honest, Valentine's Day is just whatever you make of it, so if you wanted to make it a holiday to celebrate your queer platonic relationship, go for it. That sounds fantastic. If you want to confess your feelings to someone, be that queer platonic feelings, if you have a squish on someone, or just telling them that, hey, I think you're real cool, and I would like to do some things with you, in whatever fashion that may take, go for it. I am by no means a relationship expert, but I can tell you with great certainty that if you have feelings and you just keep them inside and don't tell them to anyone, nothing will ever happen with them. I get a lot of people commenting on my videos that they're like, ah, oh, this is so relatable, I have no idea what romantic attraction feels like. And, um, yeah, totally valid. I've been there, I am still there sometimes. But it's okay to not know, actually. It's okay to talk it out with other people, whether that's a trusted friend, or if you want to talk it out with the person you're into, if you have that sort of relationship. That seems incredibly scary, but some people are cool about it. That might even bring you closer, to be honest. I feel like I'm doing a lot of talking, but I'm not actually getting anything across because I didn't script this video in any way. So I guess that's all for now. Apologies if the video and or audio is terrible because I didn't test it at all before this. I guess one of the lessons here is if you want me to make more videos, comment and let me know. I do read all of the comments, still I get notifications for every single one of them. I do see everyone who subscribes and thank you so much to the people who have subscribed since I last made a video. like over a year ago. I uploaded one that was me streaming, which I still do sometimes over on Twitch, but why you subscribe to a channel that doesn't have any new videos is just beyond me. I appreciate it, I just don't understand it. I did have some friends find this channel, so that's weird. And my fridge just turned on, so I guess that's the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you somewhere. You're most likely to see me over on Twitch, but to be honest, my life has been a little chaotic lately, so I'm not sure how much I'll be anywhere. Also, thank you so much to all of you who have stayed subscribed to this channel. Again, don't understand it, but I appreciate it. Because I'm still here, and you're still here, so maybe something will happen someday. My throat is real sore, so I'm gonna be heading off. Happy Valentine's Day if you decide on celebrating. If not, that's cool too. Looking forward to the cheap chocolate afterwards. See ya.